Hey guys, welcome back to Hoarder's Heart. On this episode, we're going to be going over the Operation Christmas Child Shoebox Packing Party. If you're new to my channel, hey, thanks so much for stopping by and checking me out. I'm a hoarder, and I conceal my identity by putting the sunglasses on and the phone in front of my face, because I still feel a little too woo vulnerable to admit to the world who I am, and here's all my messes and mental struggles. <laughs> but no, this episode is one that's more therapeutic in healing in my hoarding. I've been doing the Operation Christmas Child Shoeboxes for, oh, I guess, the past, like, five years I want to say and I've been doing it with my boys because it feels so good to be able to give to children who don't have anything. So basically what we do is that we wrap these shoe boxes and we fill it with toys and toiletries and school supplies for children who are in need because my goodness, we are so blessed with so much stuff here, uh, too much stuff. So it's really good for my hoarding to, to give, to feel that happiness of giving and not holding on to the stuff for my anxiety, to just associate that letting go of our stuff can also bring happiness, not trigger a panic attack. So I, it helps me with that association. So guys, without further ado, let's get started. Dollar Tree, so we're gonna get toothbrushes, washcloths, uh, a comb, a brush, a uh, bar soap, and that way we can give them brand new toiletries to put into the box. I'm gonna head to the register. I got everything that I really needed. I did get a couple of little girl things because I'm, I'm making a girl box. So, um, and the boys are gonna be using a lot of their toys that are new to put in their gift boxes too. So, all right, let's get out of here. All right, guys, so we're getting ready to go to the church who is hosting the packing party today. So here is the box of toys and things that we had had that we are going to be donating. Here's some uh, papers that we'll be coloring um, when we're there, when they're um, packing it. Here's some more little things. Remember the markers? So we have a whole bunch of little um, Chotsky things that we picked out and that are leaving our house and that are going to be given to these children who live in like third world countries and don't have a whole lot. So that's kind of what the shoe box looks like. So this means a lot because it's teaching my children to give to children who, you know, don't have a whole lot, you know, and, and we, we clearly have a lot <laughs> and we're working on downsizing that and what better way to do that than by giving things to make other children and people happy. All right, we're at the church right now and what everybody is doing is they're setting up everything in categories. So of course we have all of our little toys. Uh, they're putting them in baskets and then plushies. They're over here and we're going to have a section for toiletries and school supplies because everyone brought in so much stuff that they're going to do an assembly line uh, to fill their boxes. Now me and my boys, we brought our own stuff for our boxes. So my boys are doing a boy each from five to nine, and then I'm doing a girl five to nine. So as soon as we fill up our boxes, we're going to go ahead and help All everyone right, out. Right now, my oldest son is uh, helping out, and he's ripping the little papers so that she can cut them to say boy or girl. Because each box, uh, as you can see, it's labeled. So they have an age group for boys, and then they have separating girls as well by age group. Yeah.
pieces that they made. They made so many bins. This is gonna make so many kids so excited when they open it. And it's for Operation Christmas Child. And I'm just so thrilled to be able to be a part of this so that we can go ahead and have all these kids be so happy. All right, guys, we are home from the church and all those boxes, they are ready to go to make children all over the world so happy. And I do very much enjoy watching those videos of the kids excitedly opening up those like Operation Shoe Box uh, boxes. They're just so happy because sometimes that's all they get like throughout the whole year. And it just makes you really put things into perspective of they look so excitedly to that little tiny bit and look at all that we have. And it's like, no wonder my kids don't enjoy it because there's just so much. So you can't really look at it and be like, wow, this is really special because there's too much little special things. <laughs> and Lord knows I probably could have given a lot more away to that Operation Christmas Child, but you know what? I am a hoarder and it's a mental illness and it's a mental, um, uh, struggle and it's not that I can't do it because I am strong enough and we are doing it. We're we're cleaning out this playroom little by little, you know, but it's just like I said, as part of my healing journey of hoarding, uh doing things like this, giving them away, giving the toys away to children who I can see be so happy, that brings warmness and heartness and it brings me that associating that letting go of your stuff can be a positive experience and not a negative loss. So guys, I'm going to wrap up this video and I just want to say, man, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you next time. Bye.